So today, let's pledge for carbon neutrality with our first baby step. The challenge of our generation and the delegate it, noting that climate change is catastrophic. Realizing that the only way out of impending climate crisis is to achieve the carbon neutrality by 2050 or latest by diversity of open and inclusive processes to share and obtain data and information about climate change and the need to counter disinformation. Russia is not bothered about it. We are also not much bothered. We are far away from this. But do we know, as principal has told us, that there is a war that we have waged against nature. And we are throwing our atomic bombs of greed on the nature. This is going on for a long time. Seven million are displaced in Ukraine alone due to the war. But the 7 billion population on the earth is in a danger of displacement. People would be moving from the coastal area to the high up because of the sea level rise due to the climate change. And the population from the mountain will be moving back to the plain because of the flooding and the landslides. And the people in the plain, they are not going to be safe. They will be suffering from the water shortages and droughts. I don't know how many of you have seen that China has declared a national drought emergency just in pain, have declared a national droughts. We are not aware of it because we are in a monsoon. But it's not only droughts, it's a question of food shortages, water shortages I mentioned. And I think we are in the trouble of getting extinct. Now you may feel that Dr. Rajendra Shinde comes and only gives us a threat that we are going to get extinct. But this is a United Nations report. Is the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, which has gone on the record with the consensus of nearly 5,000 scientists and technologists in the world saying that the sixth extinction is approaching us. Five extinction have taken place. And remember, after five extinction, with all those disasters, only one who survived is a nature. So don't think that you are putting atomic bombs on the nature. Nature is not going to die. Nature is the one which has survived at the end. And it will start reacting back to you in the form of droughts, in a form of floods, in a form of making your life miserable, 
in a slow way. 